welcome to the nature of science and science education course this is a part of reflective teaching with ICT that is RTICT program that is offered by the center for education innovation and action research the center is a part of the Tata Institute of Social Sciences my name is Shamin Padalkar I am an assistant professor at TIS I have been part of designing this course and I will be your primary force fac course facilitator. Others from TIS and outside TIS will also help in facilitating this course. You can pause here if you want to read more about me. Here is some basic information about this course. It is worth 2 credits as per the UGC norms. The total duration of the course is 6 weeks. And all that you will need to complete this course is a computer or a smartphone with access to internet, science textbooks and a journal or a notebook to note important points, record observations and express your thoughts. Some of the activities will also need you to access a classroom or at least a group of five children with whom you can interact with. The objectives of this course are that at the end of this course you will be able to think broadly about science and science education. Understand the guiding principles of science education. Analyze the pedagogic practices and educational material. And modify your teaching practices and analyze and curate pedagogic teaching learning material such as textbooks and digital resources and appropriate it for your own context. Here is some more information about the course. This course is designed for the teachers who wish to acquire a state of art knowledge in the field of science education. Aims of science education, our understanding about nature of science and our knowledge about how children learn together determine what we teach that is curriculum how we teach, that is pedagogy, and how we assess. So the following four questions will be discussed in this course. First, why teach science? Second, what do we want our students to learn when we teach science? Third, how do students learn science? And fourth, how to teach science? At the end of this course, you should reflect whether your practice is consistent with our goals of science education and nature of science. If you find that some of the practices or aspects are not in accordance with the aims of science education or the very nature of science, then this course will leave you with the question, how can we improve it? Here is a sneak peek to the course. This course has the following units. First, the introduction. The unit which you are viewing now. Unit 1 is about aims of science education. Unit 2 is nature of science. Unit 3 is fostering scientific thinking in classroom. Unit 4 is science education in practice. And at the end, there is assessment. You can spend about one week on each unit, but of course you can go faster and complete it before six weeks. Each unit requires you to read articles, watch videos and think about them and do some activities, sometimes online, sometimes off offline with, with your students. So looking forward for a fruitful interaction with you, a very all the best for this.